Hey guys, I'm Dr. Kate Adams from Bondi Vet and today I'm back in Chapel Street Precinct down here in Melbourne. It is one of Australia's most fun and famous entertainment and shopping precincts. It's also one of Australia's most dog friendly public places and that's something I love. And today I'm in the mood to check out the famous Chapel Street Precinct food culture. And what better place to start than the intriguingly named Massive Wieners? This here is our colossal wiener. Um, it is our challenge. So over here you're looking at the wall of shame. So most people generally end up on the wall of shame. They haven't eaten the wieners. They finished the wiener, but uh -huh. they haven't done it under five minutes. Oh, that's the so challenge. So back behind you is the wall of fame. 10% of people make it on the wall of fame and most people end up on the wall of shame. Okay guys, and we have two hungry blokes up for the colossal wiener challenge. So you guys ready? Steve versus Nathan against five minutes. Three, two, one, go. <laughs> so less chewing, more swallowing. <laughs> Come on you guys. 30 seconds. Keep going guys, you're doing really well. This is hilarious. Come on, you guys, the guinea pig will go faster than this. Well, they've certainly pulled a crowd, even some four legged wieners. Let's go! Woo! Five, four, three, two, one! Come on, you guys. Hands up. Keep going, well guys. Done. You're going to go under the bench. <laughs> oh, I don't think Nathan's going to fish his either. Good dog. I think Nathan's going to be sick. <laughs> That was just insane. And the Speakeasy Bar is one of the best examples of the dog-friendly culture here. It's packed with happy locals and their canine companions. Love this, pour on the door, dog-friendly. I'm one of those people, if you can't take your dog, I'm not going there. We let them in, they're not allowed to drink. Uh... It is one of Australia's most dog-friendly places, I'm sure of it. It's absolutely fantastic, and the businesses that you know, do encourage people to bring their pets are the ones that are very busy because yeah. people want to go out and socialise and yeah. bring their animals with them. I do. I have to say, I'm loving the look and the dog-friendly feel of this whole Chapel Street precinct. I can see now what all the fuss is about. Little Green is your classic hole-in-the-wall cafe. Look at this. Cass, vegan, what are these? Vegan berry smoothie and a clean green smoothie oh with peanut butter and greens. Oh my goodness. I just can't wait. <laughs> There's a lot of dogs along Chapel Street yeah. and we have some very famous dogs called yeah. Muppet and Bear that come in. They have over 50,000 followers, so they're very well known in the area. Hello, how are you? It's okay, nice to you? meet you. Nice to meet you both. These two are little Insta-celebs. Yeah, kind of. My obsession with taking too many photos uh -huh. and sharing them with everyone. Hey guys, I have had such a fun day in the Chapel Street precinct. I have eaten and drunk my way through the entire day and I'm ready to hit the fashion shops. That'll be up next on Bondi Vet Chapel Street Special.